this summer. Uh, I, I knew I didn't want to redshirt, and I talked to Coach McCaffrey coming in since day one. He, he asked me if I wanted to redshirt, and I told him no. And that's when we made the decision. Okay. How comfortable? No, I was just going to ask, well, how are you a better player? In what areas are you a better player than the guy we saw last year? Uh, I think I'm a lot more consistent mm -hmm. and uh, a lot more leadership than last year. Consistent in what? In your offense or defense or what part of the game? Uh, probably just all around, just attacking the basket, finding open people and just knowing what to do. I know your ball handling had to be something you really focused on since you're running point. I mean, what, what's your drill work been like in the summer? How much more attention to detail did you pay this year versus, say, even a year ago when you came uh -huh. in in the summer? Uh, I've worked a lot throughout the summer with Coach Brown. We've been just uh, doing a lot of ball handling, a lot of finishing around the rim, and just attacking, just being strong with the ball. What's, uh, what's kind of been the breakdown in practice? I mean, you guys kind of, you and Jordan kind of switching off ones depending on the day, possessions, that sort of thing? Uh, through a, most of the prices, we've been kind of competing with each other. We haven't really been on the same team, but uh, I've been kind of the one, and he's been kind of the one on each and each other team. But when, when we have been on the same team, I mean, it's been uh, pretty good. I mean, just see what, what we're doing in practice. What's, uh, you know, I mean, is it a pretty much an expectation you both are going to play, probably play a lot? Probably almost even minutes. It's just a matter of who opens the game, mm -hmm. and, and even then, that's probably not that big of a deal. Yeah, I think it's going to be a, a lot uh, even minutes. I think either either one of us is going to start out at the point, and then once one of us come in, then we'll move to the two or the three. So it looks like there's a lot of people uh, that just have a lot of uh, you know versatility on this team. You do, obviously. Mm -hmm. Jordan seems to. A lot of other people. How helpful is that for you guys right now, just to try to get into a flow? Because you have so many newcomers mm -hmm. and. and position player? Uh, I mean, it's, it's great. I mean, everybody can pretty much play a lot of positions, and uh, everybody can pretty much guard one through five, so that just kind of helps with us defensively, and I think that's going to help all around with just being able to get into people and uh, cause havoc. Every point guard under Coach McCaffrey has shown an ability as they went through their career to do a better, better job of getting to the rim off the dribble. Where, where are you with that now? I think I've gotten a lot better at doing that. And Coach actually mentioned that to me after uh, practice on Tuesday. He said that I'm attacking the basket at a pre elite level. Where do you move once uh, if you're going off the ball? Where do you go? Do you go to two? Do you go to three? Uh, well, if Pete's in the game, I usually go to the three, and uh, Pete's usually at the two. And your defense, obviously, I know that coaches really like that before. Uh -huh. Is that another part of your game that can be utilized? If you're at the three, you're going after the number one backcourt player. Yeah, that's what Coach Brown's always uh, harped with me. He said he thinks I can be a really good defender, and uh, that's what he's kind of been working on. What do you like the most being a point guard in an up-tempo system? What, what do you enjoy the most? Uh, just liking to have an ability to either attack the basket or find uh, our open shooters like Brady or Pete.